Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park, Toledo, located at 31 Audubon Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2019 Toyota Tundra. Now the most notable features on this Tundra is its heated front seats, soft tonneau cover, along with its satellite radio. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle, just to get you better familiar with this 2019 Toyota Tundra. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this Tundra is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lamps and then if we take a closer look just over on the side, as you can see you have your fender flares along with your 18 inch aluminum alloy wheels. Running boards, taking a look up top you have your foldable mirrors, heated mirrors, and the color we're going to be taking a look at today is white. Now. Taking a closer look just at the front dash as well as the front seats, you have your cloth interior with your power driver seat with lumbar support. Over on the left hand side you have your mirror controls along with your automatic high beams and then taking a look on the inside of the driver's side door you have your window locks, power locks and window controls. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your seek function, volume control, as well as your mode select, voice recognition, Bluetooth connectivity, lane departure alert, as well as your cruise control. Now taking a closer look just at the multi-informational display, you'll see a couple of different features on here. So as you can see, you have a digital speedometer with your range, fuel economy, and then you also have an exterior temperature gauge. Scrolling through, you can go through the audio as well as the lane departure alert, tire pressure monitoring, trailer brake, messages, and settings menu with the lane departure alert, pre-collision system, as well as a couple of other additional features. Down below on the right-hand side, you'll find the traction control on and off, tow haul, and trailer brake. Taking a look at the center dash area, you're going to find a couple of different features. So inside the apps menu, you have your audio phone as well as a couple of other additional features. XM satellite radio, hazard lights, temperature control settings, 4x4 select. Your heated seat controls will be just located underneath there with your USB and auxiliary input. And it's matted to a automatic transmission. Now, taking a look at the backup camera, as you can see, you have those nice guiding lines in there making things much easier for you when you back into a stall. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate. Now, as you can see on the rear bumper, it's a three-piece, so in the event that you damage the one section, you just have to replace the one segment. Connectors for your towing as well as your spare tire located underneath, and then you have the backup camera as well as the lock for the tailgate. Closing in on the rear cargo bed, as you can see, you do have the bed rail system in there, so with the bed rail system, you can readjust the cleats that you see on either side there, place them all in one side of the bed rail system, or take them out all together, just depending on what your needs are for. On the left, right, front, and back side, you're going to see a couple of areas where you can tie down some loose cargo just so it's not shifting around to the back of your bed while you're driving. The other nice thing is that you do have the soft tunnel cover, so if you have um, additional cargo that you have in the back bed there that you don't necessarily want getting hit by the elements, it definitely comes in handy. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Audubon Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sbtoyota.com to get us by email. Once again folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.